Candlestick Park, a stadium that has housed numerous championship teams, plays host for this showdown between the Bengals and the 49ers. AFC versus NFC as kickoff fast approaches, Phil. Well, we have two teams that don't know each other very well. And when you don't know each other very well, you play cautious. And when you play cautious, you don't play as well as you should. So it should be a high-scoring game. Always a threat, and he'll start his return now. He steps out. First down. Go. Out of the one, shotgun. Two, three, one, Goes deep to A.J. Green. Almost intercepted that time. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position knocks it down. down coming up throws the pass A.J. Green with the catch good job by the receiver that time getting that extra couple yards gets a first down they are marching let's see how the defense reacts That reception gave them the first down. Takes it from the eye. They knock him down behind the line of scrimmage. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Second down and 11. Toss to the outside. Breaks free. And now they'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. The defense doesn't want to give up runs like that, so how do they stop it? Well, they start crowding the line of scrimmage, so you keep crowding that line of scrimmage. Look out. They'll throw it over the top. Now looking at third down. Looking to the right side and throwing. Gets a hand on that one to knock it away. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield. Punt the football. Receivers are bunched up. Here's the quick toss. And he's out of bounds. Bad play call that time by the defensive coordinator. It's fourth and short. There's only a couple plays you know the offense is going to run. They were not ready, and they give up a big first down. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Gain of 12. Beautiful touch pass that time by the quarterback. He dropped it right in there. And this is a pass that every quarterback must have in his arsenal in the NFL. First down here after the completion. Looking long. Inaccurate with that one.
lined up in the pistol formation. Second and ten. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Well, this defense all over that play. They tackled the runner for a loss. Now we're going to have third and long. Advantage goes to the defense. There's Marvin Lewis down on the sidelines. And, of course, it's a transient position in the NFL, a head coach. He is now the second longest tenured coach in the NFL. How about that? It's pretty impressive when you talk about Marvin Lewis. He withstood a team that was always in trouble off the field. They've kind of turned a corner. Now they got a bunch of guys that just love the game, know what to do on the field. And Marvin Lewis has led them to the playoffs the last two years. Third down following the run. They motion the receiver around to the other side. Goes deep to A.J. Green, and it's incomplete. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. An extra tight end on the field for this one. receiver on the right. Intercepted. In on the stop. Right, well, I have to say that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Gore is going to secure the handoff. Taking off. Impressive piece of running by Gore. Good job that time by the running back. I'm sure he's a little winded after that play. He showed that speed getting out there and picking up those extra yards. Here they come back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. Game of six. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it, and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. And here we have second down. Michael James gets the carry. He's got some daylight. And Vontaze Perfect brings him down. What a job that time by the offensive line. That hole was so big, he could have drove a car through it. The running back hit it full speed, and that allowed him to get down the field and get that long run. The offense back to the line of scrimmage after going for more than 40 yards on the previous play. When you make play calls like that, you're not going to win many football games. That was a terrible call here on first down. Second down, following the run. The throw to the left. 49ers in for the score. Well, we're talking about some of the fastest humans on earth. And we take into account you can't touch them or breathe on them. That's how they're able to get open and make so many catches. Driving extra point is good. Defense. The defense, a little jumpy right there. The 49ers for the extra point. Extra point is good. The Bengals are ready to return the kick. And 
and he'll start his return. And he's tackled right at about the 28-yard line. and 10. First down, offense readying for the snap. Reed makes the tackle. After that long run, that running back deserves a break. Go over to the sideline, let a few guys pat you on the rear end and tell you how good you are and then get a little oxygen and get back in the game. What a run. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. After the catch, it's now second down and one. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Good yardage picked up on that call. Well, the defense in the perfect situation at time. They make the quarterback throw it short, but then nobody makes the tackle. Get in position, wrap your arms around the legs of these receivers, and bring them down. Welcome back to the action. Today, it's been all about the defenses. the slot and the second quarter is underway with this snap what a good job by the defensive player they are just flushing the running back and driving into the ground offense lines up here second and one no one in sight has the grab good job getting the first down by the offense and look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on keep us on the sideline a little longer that's what they're hoping for that was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. That pass incomplete. us to second down tosses it to the running back and pick up about four nothing too exciting here just plowing ahead getting closer to that goal line well they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them so far they haven't this and that pass is picked by Carlos Rogers Colin Kaepernick under center. First and ten. They'll go ground. And they're going to run it right. try over again on second down. Frank Gore gets it here. That's a good job by the defense, just playing the situation. Second and short, they know they have a conservative coach on the other side. They played for the run, and they stopped it short of the first down. And there's Jim Harbaugh, his first two years as a head coach, all the way to the NFC title game. The next year, another step, all the way to the Super Bowl. Oh, boy, no more doubt Jim Harbaugh. This guy is just one terrific football coach. He did it at the University of San Diego. He did it at Stanford and with Andrew Luck, and he's done it in the two years he's been in the NFL. He's a great quarterback coach, and he is a leader of men. He made a decision 
midseason in 2012 to go with Colin Kaepernick. That took a lot of guts to make that call, and he proved that in the end it was the right decision to make. Well, he played quarterback, Jim, for a long time in the NFL, so I think that experience of being a quarterback in the league and then just having the toughness and the courage to make such a controversial change, I think we all now can look at it and say, oh, he made the right decision, but when he did it, boy, there were a lot of second-guessers, but Jim Harbaugh has shown everybody he knows a lot about football. And second and ten. It's handed to the running back. Gain of seven. Good job by the defensive player squaring up that running back and just put his big butt right into the ground. Frank Gore is in the backfield. Kaepernick's going to take the snap from the shotgun, and that's a gain of 10. Oh, he got us a nice drive going here, Jim. Another first down. They are just making one solid play after another and just marching down the field. Colin Kaepernick under center, first and ten, and James is going to take the handoff now. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. An off-tackle run, it's a staple of all offenses in the NFL, and a general rule is you run off the right tackle because he is the power tackle where the left tackle is the pass blocker. Gores lined up in a single back formation. Second down, three for the first. Throws to the right, makes the catch. Well, when you get a couple first downs, it just gives you such great confidence. It makes everybody relax. And I always say this, when you're a relaxed athlete, that's when you play your best. This will probably be the last play before the two-minute warning. First and ten. James got it on the toss. We've hit the two-minute warning here in the first half. It's been a beautiful drive so far by this offense, Jim. They started in bad field position. Now they're inside the 20. Let's see if they can get it done from here. Marching down the field and taking their time. First and ten. It's away from the pressure. Looking to the right side and throwing. The ball's deflected incomplete. He did everything right, didn't he? The cornerback that time. He was physical. He stayed on the wide receiver. He was reading the quarterback. So it was easy for him to knock the throw down. This long drive continues. Second down and 10, and the give to Frank Gore. Mounting a serious drive. Third and 10. Screen pass. Makes the reception. A tackle that had to be made. And that'll set up fourth down. Good job by the defense. Staying in the right spots. They give up the short pass. They make the tackle. And now we have fourth down coming up.
The kick is good. Yeah, that was a good job that time by the defense. They were bending. They did not break. And all they did was give up a field goal. He's a dangerous returner and he'll have a chance to show you right here. And he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. A receiver in the slot looking for some daylight up the middle. Second down coming up. Tossing it to the running back. Bringing the play to an end. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're a running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. Third down and five. Just had to avoid the sack. Incomplete. Lines up here. That's a failed conversion, but you might as well look at it like a turnover. It's going back the other way. Terrible game management that time by the coach. It's three downs, it's four down. What should you do? Well, I think you should punt it. He goes for it and puts his defense in a tough position. Corners formation here for the defense. First and ten. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. As much as these guys practice during the offseason, training camp, during the week, you think receivers and quarterbacks would always be on the same page. That time they were not, and it's another incomplete pass. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. Makes the catch in open space. And he's brought to the ground. That's a nice job by the offense here. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Well, Michael James. They break through. Tackle him behind the line. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Lines up here. Second and goal from the five. He's got the touchdown. It's like money. How much do you need? The answer is more. And that's what you do when you're trying to get points in the NFL. Just get more. Good job by the offense. They pad the lead with that touchdown. And the extra point is good. 49ers setting up for the kickoff. He'll start his return. And he's 
tackle just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First down here. Trying to plow ahead. Running it like it's an option play. Makes the tackle after a pickup of 15. That does it here for the first half. Bengals trail in this one. We're back here now in this one where the 49ers are leading by 17. Danielle's got an update from the sidelines. Let's go to her now, Danny. Guys, I got a chance to quickly speak with Colin Kaepernick during halftime. So far, his team is out in front, and he told me the important thing now is playing smart. If they can control play and just avoid costly mistakes, they'll be in good shape in this second half. That's all from down here, guys. Back to you. Thanks, Danielle, and now we'll go to the field. Come to the line, and it's first down. And on Bolden with the catch. you got to be able to adjust when you run these drag routes across the field. The throw cannot always be right on target. Can you reach behind, make the catch, and keep going full speed? That's the sign of a good wide receiver. Colin Kaepernick under center. Second and six. High formation and the handoff. Met at the 40-yard line. Good job by the running back that time. Finding the open hole and picking up those extra yards. First down here after the run. Play clock's running down. Leaning on that running attack again here on first down. Gore is in the backfield. They need to get the playoff. Looking for an open receiver on the right. What a hit, and the ball is dropped. Good job that time, Jim, by the defender. He hit that receiver so hard, that football came flying out. That's why it's incomplete, the big hit by the defender. And Manningham's lined up in the slot. Pass is made, and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. Lined up now as a slot receiver. Kaepernick from the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. No one's going to get him now. The 20, the 10. In stride and he's home for the touchdown. Nowadays, so many kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score touchdowns, they get to do dances, and... You're not really allowed to hit them either. What a job. The Bengals are ready to return the kick.
Ran the tape with a chance to run back this kickoff. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Well, Jim, I know his family's watching, so we'll give all the information we can as soon as we get it. But it looks like it could be a major injury, and I just, well, I hope the best. First and ten. Alden Smith with the quarterback takedown. This defense, they are definitely not faint of heart, are they, Jim? They will bring the pressure. Good blitz that time, and they take the quarterback down. He'll fire it out to the left. A.J. Green with the catch. In this league now, you've got to keep these wide receivers and quarterbacks guessing. You just can't come out there and play man-to-man -man every play and think that's going to work. You've got to mix in some zones, some blitzes, and then occasionally go man-to-man -man cover. Johnson's got it in the gun. Looking to go deep. Reed makes the interception. What a terrible job by the quarterback. But nobody's open. Tries to force the pass and look. What's it turn into an interception? First down on the way. Michael James gets the carry, and he's tackled at the 32-yard line. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front, and that time they stopped that run just for a short game. Colin Kaepernick under center. Second and eight, Gore, swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Well, these plays do look ugly, but they don't work. It's, it's second down, and you run the running play, hoping to pick up a few yards to make third down easier. But when you lose yards like this, third long, tough to do. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. Punters all set here. Gain of two. Well, returning punts is a tough job. It's about judgment. That time, that was poor judgment by the Return man should have just had a fair catch and never tried to return that. Let's roll! Let's roll! They face first down. The quarterback will hand it off. They run right. The tackle is made. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. He sends the halfback in motion. Johnson's going to take it from the gun. Ball's out. Oh, they cough up the football, and the defense takes possession. Well, the one thing we know about the NFL, when you have the football in your hands, they are going to attack it. You've got to know that as a ball carrier, protect it a lot better. Down coming up. Setting up a little screen. He's got some daylight. Good piece of tackle. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. They've got a first down now after that catch. 
McCoy is going to throw once again on this down. Davis got the cool hands on a pass that had a lot of heat. Well, it was man-to-man -man coverage. Bad job by the defense. The defensive back so slow, no chance of keeping up with the wide receiver. Frank Gore is in the backfield, challenging the defenders to the right side. Touchdown. You gotta take advantage of situations like this. Not often in the NFL do you get somebody this wide open. Good job by the receiver. Nice job by the quarterback seeing him. And what do you get? An easy touchdown pass. Makes the PAT. 49ers setting up for the kickoff. And he begins his return. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. Ohio! Ohio! They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Running to the left side. He is tackled at the 40-yard line. The Bengals still on offense to start the fourth. Capped off the third quarter with a huge play. Left round! Left round! Here is the first snap of the final quarter. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. So many things you can do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Second and 13. Throws to the right. A.J. Green there with sure hands to pull in the rocket pass. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done then. That time, quarterback had time. And throws it down the field for another completion. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. Good job by the offense. They're in the red zone. They're down by more than seven, but the defense, can you stop them and just give up the field goal try? Second and three after that last carry. What a catch. Touchdown. Something you always got to be alert for nowadays in the NFL. The fade route, the defense caught off guard just a little bit. Nice throw, nice touchdown. The Bengals for the point after. Oh, it's a fake. So, put down a touchdown and a two-point conversion on that occasion. Yeah, good job by the offense. They executed the play perfectly, and they got in the end zone, like you said, and got that two points. receiving team has recovered. lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Now first and ten. Hand off. Up the middle. Holds him to seven. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Working that left side. Caught it, but he's out of bounds. That's a nice route that time by the wide receiver running the corner route and the quarterback just throws it too far and misses him. So after that last incompletion, it is third and three. Look at 
intercept. Lucky intercept. Here we go now. Green, 39. McCoy standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. The tackle was made. First down is picked up. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. And it came up a yard short. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. And Crabtree is going to get set in the slot for this snap. Second and one. And they sack the quarterback. Well, if your offensive line is not good enough just to stop the pass rush, then you got to help them out. How do you do that? Well, you keep the tight end in, let him be an extra blocker, and you tell your running backs to help out too, blocking some of these defensive linemen. Third down here. here Offense go, over, trying to pick over, up the first. That ball has been picked off. Nice job of the defense that time. In position, they read the quarterback's eyes, and it led to an interception. down here. Easy catch there. No one near him. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Loads it up. It's going deep. Complete and almost intercepted. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right Ohio. down the middle. Ohio. Second down after the incompletion. Trying to work that left side. Completion this time. That time, the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read. But these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time, in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcell said to me once about Mark Mavaro, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Looking to the right side and throwing. No separation at all. Incomplete. <laughs> this will probably be the last play before the two-minute warning here in the final quarter. Anytime your receiver running any route to the inside of the NFL, they're worried about getting hit. Don't lead them too far in a slant route. Just throw it right at them. Ohio! Ohio! 
The Bengals this time will go with two tight ends. This is going to set up a change of possession. Yeah, the crowd is always yelling. Their team is losing. Go for it. It's fourth down. Well, they went for it. Now what do you say? They didn't get it. Bad call by the offense. They shouldn't have done it. On first down. Here we go. Looking for an open receiver on the right. That pass was hurried. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a corner route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. Second down coming up. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Oh, that could have been intercepted, but he couldn't hold on. in the backfield forces a three and out every defense is looking for somebody to hit the quarterback and the best person to do it is the defensive end what a good job that time by him They're in punting formation. Seven. Very lucky that time on that punt return. The coverage was outstanding, and the returner's just lucky he didn't fumble the football. It's first down as they head to the line. play picks up a first down when you throw this pass as a quarterback you've got to stick it right onto the body of the wide receiver they are nervous because they're running across the middle they're back at the line after that catch for a first down he's looking long and intercepted makes a move and he's free that interception is strictly on the quarterback. When you make bad decisions, I don't care how good you can throw the football. The results, usually it's going to turn into an interception. The 49ers approach the line, and they're going with their jumbo package. He gets the toss. That brings the play to an end. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to, and also it opens up so many other things for your offense. Second down and three, following that nice run. Strong eye handoff here. Has the first down, now looking for more. 
Nice run that time by the running back. And if they keep running the football like this, it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense. They are being physical. The running back doing a good job, and they are making it happen in the running game today. They're able to move the chains after that last run. On first down, it's back to the ground game. Outside linebackers are just, they, they really are great athletes. They got size and they can really run. That was a good job by the outside linebacker there that time, stopping the outside run for a little game. The quarterback coming to the line hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. Frank Gore gets it here. Picks up only two. Even though the defense knows you're probably gonna run the football, it's third and short. If you run hard, all you need is a little bit of a lane. We see it there, able to get the first down. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Back to the ground. They tackle him for a loss. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. How much sweeter is practice?